My name is Dr. Samuel Augustus Pierre. I'm the Director of Hospital Services working for the Ministry of Health in Grenada. I'm David Antoine, advisor to the Minister of Health, the Honorable Clarice Modest Cohen, and I have responsibility for the donations desk in the Ministry of Health, Grenada. Everyone from ground staff to director has to be a team player. This is critical to the success of what we do here at the General Hospital. However, also critical to that success is the generosity shown by benevolent donors such as Mr. Chester Simon. Guided by our donations manager, Ms. Anne David Antoine, his intimate knowledge of the service is reflected in the items recently donated to the Ministry of Health. Well, the, we are very grateful for the donations received from Switzerland, two containers plus an ambulance and some biomedical equipment which included a defibrillator and a number of suction machines. Um, they meant a lot to us, or mean a lot to us. They distributed according to need to the various health institutions. Um, the, all of the hospitals, the main hospital, which is the Grenada General Hospital, plus the outlying hospital, which would be Princess Alice in Maribel St. Andrews, and the Princess Royal Hospital in Caracou, plus the psychiatric hospital, which is Mongay, and the Richmond Home the only home in Grenada that is fully owned and operated by the government of Grenada. The items donated by Mr. Simon, as I said, enabled us to boost our health services overall. Our services ranging from outpatient to critical care has had a well-deserved and well-needed boost. The ambulance has been allocated to Mungay, but it can be used generally throughout the service, as I said, to improve our emergency response time. It is a pleasure as usual to, to receive this gift from our benefactor, Mr. Simon. It has been long awaited, much has been said. Mr. Simon, you're a very good communicator. You let us and the public know that you had goodies for us and we had to work together. And we, we heard you and we I think we responded ably through partnership that was organized by Mrs. Ann Antoine and others from the ministry and other persons as far as Canada who came to our rescue to ensure that these supplies did come. I remember the first time I heard about Mr. Simon was um, through an email that Mrs. Ann Antoine brought to my attention and she said um, that Mr. Simon said we will have to work to find the financing for the shipping and whatever had to be done in country. Um, but you know what she said? She said, Minister, I have had a look at it and it is worth every penny that we have to put in. And so we made efforts and even while we did not seem to be making efforts, we were collecting the monies and looking for the sources. So Mr. Simon, now we have assured you that we have, we have kept our side of the bargain. And you have certainly kept yours in a wonderful way. And I'm sure if you have time to traverse Grenada and to visit the various health institutions, you will see a number of the items that you have see sent before. Because I don't know if we've said it, this ambulance is not all. We received two containers before with lots of supplies. And so the little comfortable chair, the desk here, the filing cabinet, it has gone a very long way. But this ambulance takes the cake. It does take the cake with all of this equipment because we are short of ambulances of this type. We are ever so grateful to you for it. And whoever would have been instrumental in assisting you in that, I want you to convey our thanks to your cooperation. We look forward to collaboration. And it feels so good when your own people do something for Mr. Simon, come please. I know I'm going to hand over to you um, shortly to see you. You must say a few words. Yeah, yeah. Well, first, before I hand over this key, I would like to say I'm very happy to be in Grenada. I'm being a Grenadian. But I am very surprised because, you know, people talk a lot of rubbish outside and this and that. So I came here firsthand to see exactly what's going on. 
And I was really quite surprised when I met people like Mrs. Antoine. She took me all over the hospital to Mungi, to uh, Richmond, to General Hospital, yes. And uh, I was quite surprised how I was received. I thought it was a joke, you know, because the people were so nice. So I decided to make a run for myself without Mr. Antoine. So I went back to the hospital and I got the same treatment. What the greater than people have to realize is a matter of attitude. When you go to the hospital, you must be polite, then you're going to be treated politely. There is a lot of aggressive people out there, which is causing problems. It's not much, it's a few. I talked to a few people on the island, and at the end of the day, everybody is looking for the same thing, to make Grenada a nice place, as it was to be. And I'm here, I will continue working with the Ministry of Health, with the farmers, oh, with the farmers and all the people in Grenada to make Grenada a better place. Because we have five minutes to 12, and we have to utilize these five minutes. Because if we don't do it, we don't get together, Grenada will be down in a hole. So please, I ask all Grenadians to let's support one another, help one another, and build Grenada again. And I'd like to talk Mr. George Grant, that was my platform, and Tricia, Kenneth, all the people, and don't forget, there is people out there who is really thinking about Grenada. And I'd like to make an appeal to all the big business people in Grenada, please give a little donation, no matter how small it is. So the next container and the next ambulance will be on its way soon. That's all I'm asking. And here's your key, ma'am. Here's your key. It is a well-known fact that at the moment, our health services in Grenada are extremely challenged. In that respect, I would like to send out a vitally important message to all your viewers and listeners out there, George. Our Richmond Hill home, which is the establishment in which we care for our elderly folks and people with certain disabilities, is badly in need of a facelift within the building, particularly in the areas that are provided as living quarters. So this appeal goes out mainly to construction workers, but not exclusively. Any help that you can give us will be graciously accepted because we are attempted, attempting to try to upgrade the services offered at the Richmond Hill home. Well, the Ministry of Health, you know, looks forward to a really long and um, mutually beneficial relationship between Switzerland and Grenada. In fact, I will go so far as to say it would be a great thing if we could have a formal twinning arrangement between um, Grenada Promotions or one of its affiliates in Switzerland with the healthcare service in Grenada. In upgrading the service, we are also doing so with an eye on foreign visitors because many of our foreign visitors would visit the General Hospital for care and treatment from time to time. We are extremely grateful therefore for your donations because this will enable us to raise the standard of service provided for everyone, indigenous and foreigner. Thank you.